Now we know that new triple therapy has dramatically uh, improved rates of hepatitis C cure. And however, how does this impact co-infection uh, per se, as opposed to mono-infected patients? Yeah, well, I think we're really uh, entering a very new era. Basically, we're starting to understand that maybe co-infected patients are not really different than mono-infected patients. We always have created sort of different worlds, saying that they respond less well to peg interferon ribavirin. But if you look at all the outcome data from the current trials with the newer compounds, including the Sofosbuvir interferon-free trial, or the Semepravir or Fodapavir plus interferon and ribavirin trial in co-infected patients, you will see that actually cure rates, SVR rates, are absolutely identical to what can be obtained in mono-infected patients. Now, as far as choosing uh, in the new in the era of the new DAs, uh, choosing uh, the appropriate backbone for antiretroviral therapy for HIV. Do you have any, what's your take on it, any suggestion? Yeah, so I, I think in the beginning, particularly with the first generation hepatitis C protease inhibitors, tilapavir and bisepravir, we obviously had very strong limitations in our choice of ARVs. Because mm -hmm. basically, other than boosted atazanavir, there was no other HIV protease inhibitor allowed to be combined. 